Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm hanging with Heather and Chronicles. It's my story time. So, I grew up in uh, California, and my parent, both of my parents, died when I was eleven. I went to live with my sister Kathleen, and she's passed now. Rest in peace. And so, anyways, I, um, her husband, Felix, had got me started on drugs at 13, methamphetamines, and I was in an active addiction. Um, I've been nine years clean before, and I'm currently, I had a relapse, and I'm currently four years clean. Thank God. Uh, my clean date is July 25th. 2018 and I have four children and they all live in California and I've gotten a relationship with them I live in Las Vegas Nevada and uh, this is my life And so I'm just here trying to start a YouTube channel and I hopefully that you guys enjoy what I got to post and my videos that I create. I'm trying to be a video creator. I'm currently disabled and have been for a couple of years now. I worked for McDonald's for 13 and a half years. Uh, drive through manager, uh, graveyard manager. I started off in the drive through. I made my own song, standing in back drive through, taking orders, taking cash, holding conversations. Uh, and I live in a drug free life and positive vibes only, babies. And uh, one love to all my fans and followers or subscriptions. You guys want to subscribe to my channel, go right ahead and see what I got to offer you all. And if you guys want to see some kind of type of video of my life, then I will show you. I'm going to go cut, trim the tree in the front yard and with a little mini chainsaw. And I might post that video and show you all how to use a mini chainsaw. I love farm videos, and I love the farm life and the country life, but I currently can't live that life because I live in city limits, and so I would like to just bring you my daily time and journeys through this life, and so welcome to my channel, and I will tell you stories of my childhood. I was uh, molested by my brothers, and I forgive them, and my one brother committed suicide, my other brother just broke his ankle yesterday, and so, and he currently lives with my sister, but I have forgiven them, and I've forgiven my mother for not believing me, and, but my mother passed away March 27th of 1988, and my dad my father, he, I believe that he was, a, he was very racist, and I don't believe in racists, and, but I have forgiven him for his abuse and stuff that he's put me through, and when I have, when they say dysfunctional family, no, my family was dysfunctional, and they had no... Nothing. And I am the black sheep of the family. I've been told that I'm a disgrace to the McLeans and so forth. But I don't believe in that as I am a pretty good person. I had a drug addiction. And I know, yes, my brother-in-law got me started at 13. And yes, when I got older, I knew that I had needed to get out of that addiction. And I didn't know how. And I... I went nine years clean when I moved from California to Las Vegas back in 2004, and I went nine years clean, and then I relapsed, and now I'm four years clean. I went to prison for 11 months for a crime that I did not commit, 
for just being at the wrong place at the wrong time type deal. And that woke me up to wanting to stay sober, clean and sober for a lifetime. I never want to go back to that life no matter what. I live by the no matter what club. No matter what happens in my life, I will not go back. And so, therefore, that's how I live it. And I just want to thank you for your time. And if you like this video, put a thumbs up. What's a thumbs up? What's a subscription? It don't cost you anything. But, hey, you do what you want to do because we all do what we want to do. And this is my life. So, again, one love to all my fans and followers and if you want to subscribe to this channel go right ahead um and again peace out induces one love